for the Food and Drink Federation, this is a real opportunity to work strategically with government. The main focus of the industrial strategy is to ensure that within the UK economy uh, there is um, improvements in productivity, absolutely key, absolutely key in terms of making more, selling more and creating higher level jobs. We are very keen to have a sector deal for food and drink and that focus is around export growth, uh, skills and innovation. It's critical for the UK industry to have a strategy that on the one hand facilitates producing in the UK but also uh, producing based on raw materials and packaging that come from all over the world. And then allowing for the opportunity to export many of those finished goods throughout the world. My company, on the one hand, 97% of everything we manufacture is here, but think about the ingredients and the packaging, you know, they're part of that global integrated supply chain. There are a lot of challenges facing the UK food industry and the population as a whole and there are opportunities for the food industry to really innovate in certain areas. So from creating more food from less, so producing less harm to the environment, using less water, producing more nutritionally beneficial products. So we've got a big issue of things like obesity, cardiovascular disease, type 2 diabetes. So there's opportunities for the food industry to innovate and really address some of those large, large challenges affecting society in the UK and globally. Ensuring that our sector stays at the top of its game takes the best skills in the world because we are competing globally. And that is a concern at the current time. We estimate a skills shortage of approximately 140,000 people by the year 2024. That's a gap we need to close. We need stronger partnership and engagement from the UK's universities and education, reaching back into the school system to engender a sense of passion and a real value for food and for the role of food in our lifestyles and where we need it to be. We have to address that skills gap if we're to ensure that the UK's food sector continues to nourish both its population and its economy. It's really important for young professionals like myself to have an opportunity like an apprenticeship course. It builds on their personal skills, uh, their confidence within the workplace and getting to know a corporate company and starting out in life to build their careers to go upwards. It really helps, I would say, from both aspects, the company and that young person who is on the apprenticeship because it's their future and also we are the future of the company as well.